so he's still drawing, but I think we're, we're good enough that we can go ahead and do the scarf without him falling over. We'll see. Never know. Okay, so I've just got some red fondant. Roll it into a ball. And I want it into more of a cord. So just kind of roll it flat. And elongate it. And we can keep one end just a little bit thicker. What I want to do is just take a little bit of water and it's going to go from here down and up here. Okay, so we'll kind of tuck that there a little bit. Bring this up. And then have it kind of hang down a little bit like this. And then this part, what we want to do is just flatten that. And hopefully that's secured. Use the back of a paintbrush here and we can kind of secure it in there. Okay, we can even draw some little lines on here for the scarf. Make sure it's secured over there. Okay, now this part right here, what we want to do is just kind of flatten that area and then make little cuts. You can use scissors, or I just have this spatula handy, so I'm using the spatula. Okay, and then we need the other part of the scarf to come from here and go towards the back. This one's falling down a little, so I just need a little bit more water back there. Okay, now this one's going to be much smaller. Only need a little bit and then flatten this part right here. Okay, so this is going to come and stick up like that. So we can even try to do this part right here. And then we need a little bit of water in here. Okay. Now what we can do is go ahead and add our broom. You like he's holding it here. So we just need a little bit of royal icing. I'm gonna throw a little bit more at the base. Like that. So cute. And then our little candy canes, we'll just kind of put those around the base. And then since it's snowed down there, what we could do is just take a little bit of this sparkly. You can get this at most um, arts and craft. Uh, it's in the it's a cake decorating item. It's a sparkle dust. So anyone in the art store that or craft store that sells uh, cake supplies, they usually have this glittery stuff. It usually comes in different colors. Um, I usually only buy the clear. I like the clear. Or you can find it online. Edible glitter. That's what it's called. Edible glitter. Okay? Not regular glitter. Edible glitter. <laughs> okay? And then um, if you want to add a little bit more color, you can get these little um, twins. And they're actually their little um, Christmas trees. If I can open the packet. There we go. So they're little red and green Christmas trees and it'll just, if I just kind of sprinkle them around the base, it'll just give the base a little bit more color rather than it just being the snow down there. Sometimes too, I'll take those little red peppermint candies and crush those up and those all, those look good around the base too. So if you can't find anything like this, just use the peppermint candies. And voila, there he is. He's a cutie pie, isn't he?